We're here with uh, Sean Porter. You know, Sean, this weekend is an interesting fight. Keith Thurman is facing a guy you fought twice, Julio Diaz. Julio Diaz gave you a couple good fights. The second fight you won more clearly. Um, what about him and Thurman? What do you think of that match? Um, I think Julio has shown that he's still got it, that he's still got something in the tank. Uh, definitely, probably the toughest fighter I've fought. I've ever fought. Um, amateur and pro. Um, but with that being said, we know what Keith can do. They don't call him one time for nothing. He's got a powerful punch. And uh, I'm curious to see uh, how this fight goes. If, uh, if Julio can stand in there and take those shots and you know, put up a good fight, but I do expect Keith to win the match. Okay. What is it about Keith that makes you kind of lean towards him? Like what's... Probably more than anything, uh, probably his power. Yeah. Uh, I, the kid's definitely got a lot of power. He does. Um, and you, you got to box him the right way. And uh, I know Julio is a veteran. You know, you can't overlook that. And he's smart in the ring. I fought him twice. The, the, kid, the guy is smart in the ring. They, they still call him the kid, you know. Yeah. So we'll see how youthful he is uh, Saturday night. Um, what do you think about, like, Thurman? Like, just, like, tell me, like, some of your best memories with him, maybe. Because people don't realize you've known him for years, right? I've known him for years. Um, the thing that me and my dad both say about him now is that we, we've seen the improvement of him as a boxer. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, back in the day when he was younger, he would hit guys and they would just fall out, you know. Yeah. Uh, he's, I, I've seen him now, he can use some speed and, and he can move around the ring a lot better than he could back in the day. So, I think the matches that he lost, even in the, the Olympic trials, were because he was outboxed. Yeah. And I don't, I, don't I, I think it's a little harder to outbox him now. He's more of a boxer than he is, mm -hmm. uh, you know, back in the day he was more of a brawler. How, how old were you got when you, because... Uh, when I really got hip to Keith, we we grew up, you know, together in an amateur program, but, you know, he's in Florida, I was in Ohio, we didn't really know each other. Uh, I would say more so as we got to the Olympic Games and the Olympic trials and the open tournaments leading up to that was when I pretty much figured out who Keith was, yeah. Okay, what, did you guys get along or what was he like? Yeah, we there? got along. We we never sparred. We sparred one time and I think we only did like one or two rounds. Yeah. It was some training camp that we had done and they were just two good competitive rounds, you know, not much yeah. to say about it, but we did, I sparred with him back in the day right before my fight against Alf uh, Alfonso Gomez. Okay. And that was when I probably got to know him the best was through that camp, yeah. Okay. What when you say get to know him the best, like what do you mean by that? Well we, we trained just about every day together. Uh I was I actually went down to Florida to train with him to get him ready for uh it might have been my Donna he was getting ready for and they ended up fighting someone else. Uh, I think that was how that went, but that was when we, you know, Got a little bit, you know, got to know each other and all that. And, but you did spar with him that camp? Oh, yeah. Yeah, we sparred. We put in tons of rounds. I don't know how many, but, you yeah. know, tons of competitive. What's he like rounds. when he spars? Is he like, is he real competitive, intense? Oh, yeah. We're both real competitive yeah. and intense. Yeah. Uh, you know, I always say it's not a fight, but uh, anything can happen, you know, even in the sparring. And, you know, a lot of times we, we went back and forth and it was just real competitive. Nothing too crazy or anything like that. Happened. Was Is he always treat you like kind of like good people? Like, is he like a good guy oh, yeah. like that? Yeah. Uh, I think anybody knows Keith. Keith's one of the, the nicer guys in boxing. He's like me, you know, um, more calm and cool outside of the ring. All right.